Hey, good morning. Uh, today I'm going to show you how I make my, my croutons. For, I'll make some croutons for the soup for today's event. Cut up your bread, whatever size you want. I like them big. This is one loaf. I did two loaves last night. But uh, a little oil. A little shot of oil. Or butter. Good, you know, butter works good too. A little black pepper. And a good dose of garlic powder. Normally I have my homemade garlic powder, but I seem to have mailed that to some friends. I don't have any left, so store-bought garlic powder would be fine. Parmesan cheese. I make several types of croutons. Parmesan garlic are my favorite. And a little salt. You can cut the crust off your bread if you want. Uh, sometimes I do and give it to the birds, but uh, screw the birds today. They're not getting any. Pop, toss them around good. Drop a few in the dishwater or whatever. And do it again. The oil or butter. Uh, I used all my butter la uh, last night prepping for my soup, so I didn't have any butter. So we're using oil, the salt, the pepper, the parmesan, and toss again. Uh, spread them out on cookie sheets. Uh, try not to, you know, double stack them too much, kind of one layer, and put them in a 250 degree oven for 10 minutes. Okay, after 10 minutes, pull them out of the oven, stir them around, and go for another six minutes or so. Okay, that's been six more minutes. You're not quite there. Uh, stir them around again, and then go about three or four minutes at a time until they're where you want them. Okay, that was uh, four more minutes, two different times. Uh, that's about how I want them. They break. You know, uh, keep in mind they'll continue to dry just a little bit after you take them out of the oven, and. Uh, that's how Uncle Chuck does croutons. I like a little crunch, but I don't want them hard as driveway gravel. Thanks for watching.